Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Trojan Ball Agents, welcome back to Red Air 2 Quest for 100%. Alright, and go ahead and get this out of the way. There's a legendary icon here, roughly where we lost the fisherman. Mr. Gill, but Gill or whatever. I think it doesn't matter. I got catfished. Now, I came here for one reason originally, which was I want to catch all the legendary fish. Okay. But Andy, you've already caught all the legendary fish. Actually, I haven't. And I thought this was the one I was missing. What do you mean, Andy? Oh, well, we go to Progress, we go to Capandrum. We go to Fish, we 24 out of 30, so... We have to find five of them, okay? Including Channel Catfish, ironically. Now, the reason why I'm confused is because I have fit 14 out of 15 legendary fish. I'm missing this one. I thought the fish on the map was this one. No, it's this one. But it doesn't exist because you can't catch it. All the other ones is caught one out of one. So, do not waste your time trying to catch this fish, like I did. What you can find here, if the would be too nice, oh, thank you. This is like a purple. Yeah, the redfin purple. The redfin purple. Per yeah, yeah, yeah. The redfish pickerel and the largemouth bass are in this area. That's not too bad. I've already caught the largemouth bass, but I just want to showcase where it's at. All right. Now we are in New Austin. We're here for two reasons: to catch fish and take names. By taking names, I mean finding plants. There are some plants we haven't even found. Usually that wouldn't be a problem, except we need to find four of them, which are these two, three, and four. All four of these are in New Austin. So I will meet you in a second to find these four plants. So, this plant looks very familiar, doesn't it? It looks like a current, because it is a current. This is the black current. At least I think it is. Dead iron, but I like that. I like that. So that's one of the last few I'm missing. So I'll meet you guys at the next point. And here's how that map was. During my time preparing for this, there were six I was guessing. There's two I was guessing that I didn't have that I already have. The parasol mushroom actually was one of my guesses and actually is one that I am missing. I already checked, I already picked one up. That's the only reason why I sat to say this now. The other one, I think this is it. Wait, just wander past it. This cute little herb. I have no idea what you are. I just know I need you. It's the desert sage. Hey, we need it. Come on, girl. Hey, I need it. There's three left. I will need. It. Yeah, three left. So I will meet you guys at the next one. Here is oh, here's the map for you. Right southeast of Tumbleweed. So one of the other flowers we're missing is in Rio Bravo area. I have no idea what this is. I actually randomly came across it because I had a feeling I know what the other one I'm missing is. Wait. Wait a minute. Hold up. Hold hold the phone. I knew English maze was something I was missing. Okay. Obviously, it's one, I have two left. But... On the compendium, I already found English Mace. At least I thought I did. Yeah, I already found English Mace a while ago. And I've already used it in recipes. I'm confused, but I'm okay. That means the last two are these two. And I'm excited. So I will meet you guys in a moment.
The one of the last two is around Fort Mercer. Kind of looks like Hummingbird Sage because it's a sage, obviously. This is actually the Red Sage. What a generic name. Alright, the final one we're missing kind of disappoints me. I don't know how I missed it. Okay, I do. It is actually in West Elizabeth, so I'll meet you guys in a second. I took a quick bit break from finding the last plant to go fish in this random lake. Well, oddly, I used a cheese bait to try to get the bluegill, and I got a steelhead trout. I'm not mad. I'm just a bit confused. You know? Alright, be right back. Alright, I feel kind of stupid. Because I thought the plant I was missing was in West Elizabeth. No, it's actually north of the Armadillo. And I'll tell you why I feel stupid. I remember one of the first challenges for Herbalist 1 in Red, or Herbalist in Red Dead 1 was the fever flu. I completely forgot even it thought it existed. Hello, girl. Herbalist 10. We're finally here. What madness is this? Season and cook all of the types of meat. That's an That should be backwards. Okay. Whatever. Alright, so you need 11 types of meat. That's not hard. I was actually missing two, and I'll tell you the two, because there's actually two that I've never killed. You need to kill a sheep or a ram that drops mutton. I just found one right here. Actually, I'm at the legendary uh, ram spot, but for some reason it won't trigger. So I just found a random ram and it worked. And then there's an animal I've never even seen in the game, didn't even know it existed, which okay, girl. is a crab, and I love crab. So, to find crab, you have to go to this island. Why? I don't know. So, I'm going to see if I can find it basically back at Camp 2, and I'll meet you guys there. Or actually, Camp 3. Let's go. Now, I don't normally do this. I'm going to show you where to find a crab. Now, Hey, look at crab. The fact that he loved it for one shot is shocking. Crabs are found on the random flat lake iron. Or flat iron lake. I can't word. Really, Marson? Break it down. Alright. Now we do the part that is boring. It's really easy to do Herbalist 10 after you find all the meat. So you make a cooking station. Yes, it teleported me off the island. Thank you, game. That was the one thing I was hoping for. We're gonna craft and cook. Now, I have 13 options. I did not mean to do that. Game bird is different, but I don't know where my course was because I actually made it. All right. Why can I not? Oh no. I got a bad feeling. So what you need to do is find the right herb. Just let it cook. Cook faster, dag and have it. And stow it. It makes me wonder if I have to have certain things. Might as well give the mint for the big game. It's really easy, for the most part, to do this challenge. It's significantly easier to figure out what you don't need. Might as well use it. Who knows if I have to use food ever again. Uh, we'll use thumb for this stuff of the pork. Honestly, this is very... As I already said, it's very easy. Gritty fish, I can't do. That's weird. Okay. I did buy a prime beef joint from the butcher. Hey, if it's that easy, you might as well do it. 
So I gotta figure out probably what herbs I need to use with Okay, so the crustacean I can use anything. I find there's fifteen or eleven different animals, this kinda concerns me. Like crustaceans bigger than the uh Just saying. Alright, succulent fish. These are your like, your trouts. I ain't listening to their fish. That's but Don't look like the one we randomly caught. Mutton. It's from sheep. Or ram. Or goats. I got lucky and found one randomly on my way here. Actually, I showed you that. What am I talking about? <laughs> you know I found one. Uh... Do that one. That worries me. I probably have to find certain herbs for each one, and that is probably gonna anger me. Alright, we did that, and the venison's the last one we can do, so let's do menti. Okay, so how many do I have left? Is my question. Because I know, like, it's, um, I know this is going to be a plan for this to be a longer video because I'm knocking out all four challenges that I have left. Alright, let's leave. I didn't mean to tear down the camp exactly, but we can imagine. Alright, progress, challenges, 87, that's so close. Flaky fish and plump bird. Be right back. Well, hey guys, let's go back to our favorite town in the world, Van Horn. Well, this kind of makes sense for once while we're going to Van Horn, and I feel stupid. Now we need a flaky fish, right? Oh, this is dumb. This is dumb. This is very bad. I see a flaky fish. Horse? No! How did the, that kill the- That should help, huh? <laughs> this game. About to give me a heart attack. Cat, 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 cat. One more time. Can I move? Sorry, fish. I want to catch you guys in a second. Well, this is my luck. Welcome back to... Well, Van Horn Fishing Spot, where we caught the 19-pound fish. We're here, like I said, a flaky fish or your bigger fish. Such as the muskie that we caught here previously. And luckily, we need to catch a muskie anyway, because it's one of the 15 fish we need anyway. How ironic. So let's see if we can get this fish to actually do fish things. Ooh, there we go. Okay, I think this is him. He's put up a little bit of a fight. And we'll get that muskie. Look at it. Look at that muskie. <laughs> You're okay. Crap. Hey, I needed that. I thought that was a bluegill. That makes my life a little bit easier. Okay. I kind of hope it was a bluegill, because I still haven't caught a bluegill, which is the weirdest thing, because they're found in every body of water. But... Dang. Did it that quickly? I don't know him as a big fish, that worry. It kind of worries me. Ah, uh, it's another small guy. This is another perch. No, this is actually the bluegill. No, it's another perch. Okay, game, what is this madness? <laughs> See, I just edited this episode that we just did of the other challenges, and I'm like, there he's over there. I'm just gonna reel him back in and just throw it over there. But, 
Remember, how, like, the, uh, what, literally, when I did survival, it's non. I literally just edited it. I'm like, hey, this is easy. I can just do this. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's a musky. Come here, fish. It's a real big fish, guys. Well, I'm not trying to sell out. This thing's massive. Nope. I know we're trying to do Herbalist 10, but I still need to do this for Survivalist 10. So... All left is the legendary variant. I don't know why for no reason, but I don't think it, it is. Keep that musky. We could, but we're gonna go ahead and just go straight to cooking. Cause why not? Because for Herbal is Tim, we need a plump game bird and a flaky fish. And if I'm not mistaken. No! No 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 no! What are you doing? Just not. Please tell me there's more. Please tell me there's another. God bless it, game. Well, good news is here's a side point blur. These are your turkeys. You can find them anywhere. Now, if you excuse me, I have to go redo something. Real quick, so I just want to show it off. I got the chain purple here. I need it anyway. Be right back. Alright, so I caught another musky, and the easiest way to do it is catch it, put it on your horse, cook one, and hopefully it has more than one um, flaky meat to it. I'm eating this because I don't like muskies anymore. And with that said, that is the end of Herbalist. There are two challenges left. And I thought Herbalist was gonna be the last one. You got this, girl. So let's go catch some more fish. Hold up. I'm fishing right here right now because I don't want to go straight into all the shark bested waters. This is the bullhead catfish. Get out of here. You're way too small for the eggs. Be right back. Alright. I think I said this already, but bluegill and rock bass can be found anywhere. So that's what... I mean, I'm at this random lake, or river lake thing. And I'm just trying to catch a bluegill or really okay. any fish here. I'm about 8 out of 15 now, so I've more fish to go, so I'll meet you when I find another fish. 20 seconds later, cut the bluegill. Again, I don't understand why the lake sturgeon is in a swamp. It's a lake sturgeon. Listen to the name. It's not a swamp sturgeon. Where I'm at, I'm actually up inside the fishing thing just to see what I can find. I end up finding something I needed. I finally caught a freaking channel catfish. I have been sitting here for about 30 minutes trying to catch a catfish. And I've caught 10 surgeons in a row. Now, I know there's another fish here and I'm trying to catch it. So let's see if I get lucky. So if I do get lucky, you'll be the first one to know. So I switched spots on the different side of the lake and I ended up getting the gar first try. I was kind of afraid that I was going to get some constant sturgeons here. Well that sucks. With that said, there are three fish left we have to catch. I think. Is that where we have left three? I think I do this now. I forgot about that. I had three left. The Northern Pike, which I've never even seen, so we're gonna go find that next. 
So this is the first time I actually caught a northern pike. Pretty cool fish, actually. I, mean, I have no need for them, but, you know, it's really cool to finally catch one. And that leads to one I kind of expected to be last, and the other one I thought would be one of the first ones I'd do. So, be right back. Quite a salmon. They said that's weird. I'm using the special yeah. river lure in the lake, and it's working. Well, I'm at, I'm at actually at the Veterans Homestead, and I didn't actually expect to find him here. There's one left, and I wonder if I can find him here too. So if I find him here, awesome. If I don't, well, yep. See you in a minute. And number fifteen, the smallmouth bass. So, one point point that out real quick. I come in right off St. Denis off the dock with a crayfish random. Now, I have a ma ma major problem with this. It's probably the reason why I was struggling to can't find one. Uh, where are they? Commonly seen in North Rivers. How about you? St. Denis not exactly north. Just saying. So we have one challenge left. Let me guess in a second. Alright, this couldn't have been any better to do the final challenge. I ran we go to the train station because how I've been doing it was I'll take a train somewhere to spawn the train near me and then Sir. Oh, partner. when it leaves follow it rob it hey, not get caught So this is, I'm going to tell you the easiest way to rob a train and not get caught. It's very simple. We're going to want to get some ground for a little bit so we get out of the city. That's the butcher. Can't say hi to him. Okay. We want it to get... Basically up... Oh, well, we need to go farther than that. So let's... Cut ahead a little bit of it. Hey there, boys. Sure looking fancy. Good morning. Buddy! Well, I didn't really work a way to get ahead of it, because I'm not really getting ahead of it. Sir. Sir. But, we want to get out of St. Denis anyway, so it works out. Almost a little bit farther. Now you notice I'm saying hi to everybody for a very good reason. Gives you free karma. That's part of the reason why my karma is actually at half now instead of bottom out like it was. All right, it's time. Of course, you want to put your your fancy bandana on. Put it on, right? I did not put it on. I'll tell you how much my bounty has been doing rubbing trains. Zero. This is what you. This is the best way to do it. I'm gonna kill that guy. That's not very nice. Holy cow, this horse is not going with me. Come on, horse. You can do better in this. Believe.
I feel like we're doing that last mission all over again. Why are you not going fast, horse? You're better than this. Oh, come on. We're almost there. I guess they just. The horses just suck at. Now, this is actually the first time I actually had to fight somebody because the train just. Alright. Oh. Okay. That didn't go anywhere as I expected. You've avoided all challenges, Legend of the East is available. He shot first. I'm not getting negative points. Oh crap, run. With that note, that is every single challenge done. And actually, this is the first episode of Without a Tour Mission afterwards. We have to do it. I want to do one more mission. Or one more thing we have to do. So guys, next time on Red Dead Redemption 2, we max out our cores and find some weapons. I'll see you then.